Hi. I'm going to make a little drawing of a beautiful lady. I found this on a Pixabay. Um, I wouldn't recommend this approach for beginners. Um, if you are starting to draw, I would recommend to carefully study, learn how to get the proportions right. And this approach is more when you want to try something uh, like this. Uh, and uh, maybe it works, maybe it doesn't. Um, but what I'm doing here is I just put a sort of main structure on the paper and later on I will re refine it. So now I have the eyes and the mouth and the nose and everything more or less put positions, adding some accentuations in the eyes and uh, here's some hatching. So I'm doing everything um, mixed. So there are lines that I put on the paper. There are hatchings, accentuations. And uh, I'm, I'm trying to, to define certain features gradually here, making it darker in the hairs. So there are certain hatchings that I use just to make a volume darker and other kinds of hatchings are more like trying to uh, define the hairs itself themselves. So sometimes you just want to get an overall total value here on corrected the nose a bit. and a little bit of shading there. And maybe if I had stopped here, it was a better drawing than, <laughs> than uh, the actual finished drawing because this is a nice little sketch. So with, with when you make something like this, it's always the question when are you overdoing it when when is when is it enough so now I'm, I'm going into another phase so if I had stopped let's say 20 seconds ago it was okay and now I feel I have I have to work further so I added some hatchings and some accentuations and then it starts to become a, another kind of drawing a drawing with more Total value of the draw, which is more worked out in certain aspects, and then you need to proceed more. So, but that's a sort of choice that you make during the sketching phase or the drawing phase, and sometimes you re re regret a certain step that you think, well, <laughs> I should have kept it uh, fresh and. Not that I am saying that now, because I think it, the end result is a nice little drawing, but it's something to think about, something to consider, having some darker value, total value here to define her face a little bit more. And I can adjust the side of her face a bit having more accentuations and smaller things so to get her expression better. Carefully doing her mouth. has to be very careful with the teeth because you don't want to have very dark lines between the teeth. Some cross hatching here with the shading. One direction.
and I try to to keep it energetic I try to be not too refined in a way so you can start uh, working on all kinds of details that's a choice but in this case I really wanted to keep the energy flowing keep certain energy in, in, in the way that I put lines on the paper I like this with her hair it gives a nice impression of the wind blowing through her hair also a good method of uh, <laughs> hiding a, a few faults if, if necessary put in some hairs and uh, it wasn't needed here but <laughs> pop tip <laughs> draw hairs <laughs> hide your flaws in your drawing well it's just a joke let's pretend we don't need that <laughs> and the cross hatching there Oops, okay, yep, and some more. I'm, I'm at the point of overdoing it now, again. Sometimes it's difficult to, to say, now you should stop. I think I should stop, uh, I should have stopped a little bit earlier now, but anyway, adding some hairs. Well, it, there is a point and I have, I, I don't think I've crossed that in this, oh yeah, a little bit of background. I don't think I've crossed that in this drawing, but there is a point that you are going to overwork it, that you add too much dark tonal values in the hairs or whatever. You have to watch out for that. So there's a certain balance um, and the nose was a little bit tricky. I had my doubts about the nostril on the left side, for, for us left side. So you can see that's a little bit... Yeah, I'm correcting it here and I wasn't sure if I overdid it. Maybe I should have, shouldn't have done that. Maybe it was because that's a little too dark now. And I'm going to uh, compensate that with other slightly darker accentuations and I, f I f felt I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> so here a few accentuations in the eyes to, to, to not let that dark, a little too dark accentuation that I put in the nose, to not let it stand, to stand out too much. So I tried to compensate that. But then I, I also thought, well, I should stop now. I should uh, not do too much about this drawing because I'm going to ruin it. And uh, anyway, this is the end result. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe if you like this kind of content. And like. Bye.